Hey, what up, dudes and dudes? I'm Chris from Bruce Rudas, and now I'm gonna bring you a Teenage Mutant Ninja figure review from the 80s, and this is gonna be Metalhead from the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles back in the day. This guy was awesome when I saw the cartoon and I saw this guy, I was blown away. A robot turtle. <laughs> was awesome back in the day so yeah this guy is great I like it a lot I just bought the neutral uh, mecha turtle or uh, well metalhead turtle from the new Nickelodeon uh, series and it's pretty cool just a couple of things I didn't like about this guy but it's awesome as well this guy I still love it and is one of my favorite figures or characters from that series it's just awesome just put it like this I have all the, his accessories I think so but I like the details man the details on this guy is great has a lot of details here and there like yeah it's too bright my man don't bright don't be too bright to me so yeah all overall, all his body has details, man. Here on the arm, cables and stuff, pretty awesome. Here, even uh, uh, on his uh, gauntlet or uh, glove, has details, pretty cool. He turn it has details in there as well. Just inside of the hand, it doesn't have details. So yeah, pretty awesome. The head sculpt is amazing. It's just pretty cool, very original. Check the eyes, the light piping is awesome as well. Here on the top is like a little brain, that's light piping stuff. Check that out. Awesome light piping. And the light is really up, man. I have it all day on my job today and on display <laughs> with the other uh, metal head and, and the tur new turtles. And this guy was lightning all day. Here on the leg as well, uh, it has a lot of details. As you can see, little panels and dots and and nails and stuff. Well, not nails. I don't know what bolts. Yeah, like that. A uh, little compartment here. Detail here on the leg. Pretty nice. Yeah, I mean, this guy is just awesome. The older turtles have a lot of sculpted things to them. They were just amazing. So here in the back as well has uh, details. Okay, so let me put the accessories. Okay, the first accessory they gotta put in here uh, is the belt. Also has uh, cool details. I don't know what the T stands for because his name is Metalhead. But you can see the belt is pretty cool. It has like, <laughs> grenades here. Two grenades is so pretty cool. Uh, what is this? An oil? Yeah, oil thingy going on so he doesn't rust. <laughs> I don't know what how to say this in English. <laughs> it's also for the oil, pretty cool. Here has uh, more stuff. I don't know what this are. Looks pretty cool. Bolts maybe? It looks like it. <laughs> pretty nice. And overall, it's pretty cool. Pretty cool belt. Even the belt has uh, it's, it's a sculpted. It's pretty cool. This is like a radio thing going on. Pretty cool. What is that pizza? Uh, it's like. <laughs> Like a navin transform into a backpack. That's pretty cool. <laughs> so yeah, it has like uh, this uh, switch here and there. This little thing here, a monitor here. Here on the side has little details as well. Pretty nice. Here on the bottom as well. It's pretty cool as well here. Even the straps are uh, kind of detailed. And here in the back, that's why I didn't put it in here because this is gonna also be cover so as you can see also has like a little panel there and it also has sculpt things there so it's pretty awesome a pack here for another accessory now he has his backpack so it just has two packs here like this so the other one goes the same here in the back is just a pack and a little pack hole and that's another accessory for him he has this uh, another like a little antenna or I don't know what the hell you want to call it so this thing goes on his uh, backpack like that. It's like a scanner or radar or something like that. Yeah, almost like it's gonna be a radar. He's uh, checking here on the back. <laughs> Pretty cool. And another thing that he carries, this thing. I don't remember how to post it with this thing, but uh, he comes with this. So I don't know, has details on it. Pretty cool. You can wear it on his arm like this. Or you can wear it here, like this. I don't know if I'm missing something to put it here, but uh, you can also post it like this. Looks pretty nice. The other thing is that you can take out uh, his hands and put it in here. 
let's do a spin attack or something like that, right? Pretty cool. This thing here, when I was a kid, I put it like this. I don't know if it's also, you, you can use it as a gun. But also, if you want, you can take out his other uh, hand and start it here. And uh, he has like a little weapon on his uh, forearm. <laughs> That's the way that you can pose him <laughs> with these two things here. That's the thing that the new turtle didn't carry. I mean, uh, Metalhead from the new turtles didn't carry that accessories. I mean, uh, I don't know why they didn't make this uh, go off and put another, uh, whatever. <laughs> kind of goofy looking, right? Metalhead, it's pretty awesome um, if you tell me or you ask me which one I like better I mean you already saw it there's no question about it the vintage one is better than the new one that's the way that I look at it and uh, the new one uh, you can improve it uh, you can improve it uh, easily like some couple of tips that I give you uh, maybe you already saw the, the, the customs that are made of this guy so yeah you can paint it or you can just leave it like it is and just uh, try to take this uh, hand out and I uh, just made a gun and then that's it or uh, like a spinning blade or something like that I have one of those from the tech mech uh, or mech tech weapons from Rajit I'm gonna use that this guy <laughs> and I will display it later on Metalhead from uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 80s is awesome if you don't have it and you're collecting turtles you need to get this guys amazing so this is me beers or us uh, signing out later on guys hope you enjoy it to all my friends on uh, youtube hope i can upload these videos fast laters